such a delight to be back in studio with you. My name is Nalong Rechuku, and you are watching The Strange Acts of God. This is the NSPBD Testimony Show, where we call the experts in just to go over the wonders of God that we have continued to see on a day-to-day -day basis on NSPPD. And in case you're joining us for the first time, NSPPD is the new season's prophetic prayers and declarations brought to you by Streams of Joy International, the home of what God cannot do does not exist on the strange acts of god today wow we have a power packed show and we have a power packed guest consultant who goes by the name of pastor dr dk ukuku dk he's an eye doctor He's a pastor right here with us in Streams of Joy International, and he's a dear, dear friend of the house, Pastor Dr. DK. So excited to have you back. Um, it's always my pleasure to be here with you. Yes. What an amazing yeah. and intense week it has been on NSPPD. Sure. Sure. Amazing. The, the miracles is like two weeks, two, three weeks to the yeah. end of the year, yeah. and heaven yeah. has just yeah. released the downpour of mm. testimonies. Mm. Glory to God. Mm. So before we go into our lineup for today, I'd want us to just take a look and see just a couple of the testimonies we got to see in the course of the week. So this week on NSPPD, wow, exam success after failed attempts, amazing. Creative miracle, who can forget? A removed ovary regenerates. Mm. God is amazing. What a profound testimony. Seizure terminated in the course of the week. We saw fluid in the right lung, enlarged liver, enlarged kidneys reversed in the course of the week. Eight years of barrenness terminated. Wow. Phenomenal. God is good. Breast cancer reversed on the altar of fire. We saw her father restored from coma at the blast of NSPPD prayers. Glory to God. Evil rashes, insanity reversed, and marital settlement. Reign of answers. Board exam success after 40 years. We're getting to this testimony in a bit. Nonverbal autism reversed in the course of the week. Cervical cancer reversed in the course of the week. Cancer of the bladder reversed in the course of the week. What a God. 52-year-old woman carries her twin pregnancies. Wow. Marital settlement in two weeks. Who can forget? What an amazing testimony. Four years court case settled with total restoration. Miraculous conception despite multiple negative medical reports. What Ooh. a week. What a week. Wow. What a wow. week. Wow. 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 <laughs> Wow, God, God is breaking God, protocols. God, God is doing, God looks like he's in a hurry to do so many good things, so many great things at the same time. Yes. And um, it just looks like, um, you know, when, when uh, you were talking about the ovaries, mm -hmm. ovaries mm -hmm. don't regenerate. No. They cut it off, that's it. That's it. But what we're seeing is God creating a new, a whole new pattern mm -hmm. of mm -hmm. replacement mm -hmm. of hitherto removed body parts. Mm -hmm. You know, um, if you use your normal mind, your human mind, your medical mind to process it, mm. it looks like this is not supposed to happen. Mm. But when you look at the frequency with which God is making mm. it happen and how he's multiplying the testimonies mm. Mm. again and again and again, you're left with no option but to say that really, really what God cannot what God do, cannot do does, does not, not exist. exist. Mm. Wow. Mm. Phenomenal, phenomenal. Yeah. God is awesome. Mm. And, you know, today we have amazing testimonies, five outstanding testimonies lined yes. up on the show today. Our first testifier, mm. we have Mr. Ali testifying from Kumasi, Ghana, and cancer has yet again bowed. Mm. He's testifying of healing from cancer of the eye. Mm. Amazing. Mm. Click on the share button if you're yet to. We'll be right back after his testimony. Mm. <laughs>
any growth in your eye. I see the growth start from this deeper. This is where it started. And kept moving. And kept moving. And kept moving. I don't care to know what it is. Malaba, by the power that raised Jesus from the dead. Let it be reversed, my father. Let it be reversed. Papa mentioned the case again. Cancer of the eye. They say it is spreading. Cancer of the eye. They say it is spreading. Pastor Wokoro terminated right now. You cancer of the eye. We command you. Disappear by fire. Just like that, from nowhere. Like the, the same way the, um, the eye got swollen was the same way it left just like that you wake up today you see improvement you wake up the following day you see improvement i am here to give a testimony that the last city scan they asked me to um, they asked me to go and do didn't see any tumor just like that the the result said that no tumor found I am here to give God the glory for all that he has done. Papa Jerry, God bless you. Thank you so much for the sacrifices you make for us day in, day out. God bless you. Thank you. What God cannot do does not exist. <laughs> hey! Oh my no God. No tumor found. Oh my God. Oh my oh God. My oh goodness. my God. Oh my God. You know, the facts speak for uh, itself. Look at, look at the before and the after. Uh, There's no there's no argument here. There was a healing right there. My God. My you God. Know, I thought I heard this testimony very well before now. Okay. I'm just realizing there are details. That you I missed out. <laughs> yes, missed yes, out yes. And trust me, this is the hand of God at work. Hmm. This is the hand of God at work because... Oh, what God cannot do does not does exist. Does not exist. Me, Look at not, that. Oh my, my God. Would you say that this is eye cancer right there? Would you say that that's a cancer you know, of the eye? Um, the, the, now, there are different cancers right. of the eye. You okay. know, there are, this is not the only type of cancer in the eye. Okay, so there are different types there are different of cancers types of that cancers. could show up in the eye. But, but let me start from his diagnosis. Okay. You know, um, of Hodgkin's. Course before, yeah, non Hodgkin's. Non Hodgkin's. Uh, um, lymphoma. Of course, before you narrow down mm. and say this is what it is, mm. of course, um, you know, uh, in trying to diagnose cancers, okay, you do your, like he said, he had a CT scan, mm. you know, which showed that there was a tumor. He may not have mentioned, but all things being equal, there could have been a bi there must have been a biopsy. I have reason mm, to mm, think mm, there must mm, have been a biopsy mm, or mm. histopathology. Okay, he mentioned, he mentioned that actually. Pathology. Mm. Okay, so which is what shows that, okay, which showed that this thing was actually cancerous and was aggressive. Hmm. Now, remember the tumor. Now, cancer in the eye, but there was a tumor in the sinus. Yes, a tumor in the sinus. Right. So, meaning that this had gone beyond the eye already mm. and had entered into the sinus. So, mm. Mm. it was not just the fact that it was a cancer was not in doubt. The mm. fact that it, was, it had spread was mm. not in doubt. And in treatment of cancers, you know, um, you try to cut off when there's no spread. You know, you take off, you know, whatever cancerous uh, tissues or tumors, as the case may be, then you try to go into radiotherapy. Right. You know, radiation therapy with um, heat or chemotherapy, you know, using medication. Mm, mm, mm. Now, this guy already had an established case of cancer mm. that had already spread. Hmm. And the issue now, and you know, the bad thing about radiotherapy, it is both uh, <laughs> therapeutic and harmful at the same time. Right. It can, the heat from radiotherapy mm. can cause new problems for you. Mm. If, yeah, yeah. It's not, it's not a secret. It's not a top secret. Mm. It's not a secret even. So this guy, without radiotherapy, mm. without chemotherapy, mm. without a surgical removal hey. of the tumor, Ah. And of the um, um, of the swelling yes, in the yes, eye, yes, yes. because the swelling, what you saw as swelling in the yes. eye, is not the only thing that was wrong with him. Right, because the, the eye was bulging yeah, forward. The, the, this is the socket. Right? Yes, the yes, eye socket. yes, yes. The sinus is inside. Is inside. And there was already a tumor, a tumor in, inside. in the sinus. Hey. And then without chemotherapy, oh. without radiotherapy, without a surgical removal of any. In fact, before you start doing chemotherapy and radiotherapy, most times the first step is let's even remove the ah. first. 
um, the, I mean, the tumor look at that. and all that. Mm. Without all of this, he woke up today. He hey! was there. He woke up the next day. Go everything on! had disappeared. Hey! You know, if, 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 you know, these things medically, you don't expect them to happen. Mm. It's supposed to, if it's going to shrink. In fact, something, at least. something that is spreading is mm. not going to shrink anymore. Right. Now, what you may have is that there's a tumor, but it's benign, so it's not malignant, it's not spreading, mm. but at least it's there. Yeah, it's and you there. have to find a way to remove to it. To remove it. Now, this guy's own has, is malignant, mm. it's mm. spreading, Hey. and it has entered the sinus. Yes. And the diagnosis says non-Hodgkin's uh, lymphoma. Uh -huh. So NHL is an eye cancer, and it has spread. Hmm. It has the capacity to spread, and oh. it has spread. And then you now go back for a CT scan. Even the one in your eye in the and eye. the one that has spread yes. have all disappeared, and it disappeared so dramatically that today it was dead. The next, the next morning, day, it gone. Was no there. You know, hey, um, that, this is a rare by the way, a rare form of eye cancer. Right. It's not what you see in every patient. It's not mm. what you see regularly. Mm. It's not like, um, it's not like glaucoma that is a mm. you know, regular mm. thing you see all the time. Mm. This is a, an occasional cancer. Mm. And there isn't much most times mm. that you can do because the problem is he went to the doctor. Mm. It looked like an inflammation. Right. You were treating for inflammation. Right. Meanwhile, what was spreading was spreading. Yes. And you thought yes. this was just something No, 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 in the no, no, eye, no. There was something not else. it has gone into the sinus. Mm. So you find out by the time of diagnosis for this kind of problem, mm. the patient is already at a disadvantage because what wants to spread mm. has already spread. Has already spread. But by the word of the Lord, by the word of the by Lord, by just a prophecy, ah. by a word on the altar of fire, yes, someone woke up with something today. And it was there. Tasia, by the next day, you woke up. Hey, it was no longer there. No longer you there. You went back to do CT scan because yes. there had been a CT scan yes. establishing that there were tumors, mm. or there was a tumor, and you went back and no tumor seen. Hmm. Hmm. Um, if you have never seen the hand of God before, hmm. this one is the hand of God. Hey. No man can do this for you. Hey. No, no, no medication, doctor, no treatment, no, no, no hospital. No procedure no can procedure, be this no dramatic. Yes. Even if it's radiotherapy, it's not going to be one session. Yes. You will do today, you will come back, you know, you keep yes. doing, you do today, tomorrow. Too. And it's not like, it's not even guaranteed yes. that you're going to get 100% result from yes. it. But you're seeing the young man and... It's almost difficult to believe that this is the same person who had... I mean, just look at the whole thing. My he's, God. He's looking so yes. restored yes. that you have to be told ah. that he's the same person who had this problem before. Ah. You know, there are things... Um, it's easier for me to cope with testimonies that are not I testimonies okay. for obvious reasons. Yes, but yes, yes. When I see what yes. I know, yes, yes, yes. I know by training and yes. by knowledge mm. it's not supposed to disappear mm. 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 and it disappears. Mm. Oh, come on. Mm. It's like God making a mess of what All that training. you know. Yes, yeah. yes. It's like God making a mess of what you know. I lack words to express. This is, may this kind of thing not happen to anybody you know. Amen. Because. Amen. It's not even, like I said, you don't even discover on time that this is what it is. Mm. You're not, you don't see swelling in the eye and the first thing that comes to your mind is that this is a cancer. Mm. You're, you're thinking this is an inflammation or an irritation or response to allergic mm. reaction, blah, blah, mm. blah, mm. until, and then you now find out there's a tumor, there is, so the, and this is aggressive. Yes. And what it means is that it was Has not going to, it was to not going go to stop, to the next it was eye. not going to stop at the sinus. Yes. It could even get into the brain. The next, oh, it could get right. into the throat. Just like any other cancer. Yes, just, just like, like any, any other, other cancer. cancer. Mm. So, and it's aggressive. Hmm. And you know, there are cancers that are not aggressive. They are bad enough, but hmm. the one that is aggressive means it is, it's, it's invasive. It's trying yes. to get to everywhere yes. overnight, but by the word of the Lord. By the word of the Lord. Know, and I, he hasn't lost vision in his eye. I yeah, mean, he's yeah. still <laughs> looking through his two eyes, only cancer God, gone, everything trust me, gone. Only God can make this happen. My God. This dramatically. Yes. Even if there was going to be intervention, mm. you remove the tumor. How about the one that has spread further? Yes. How about the, you know, like the eye doesn't, you know, it's almost difficult to hey! reconcile the before and the after. And the after. If, if it wasn't him testifying, you right. would say you've right. never had this before. Mm, 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 but mm, mm. you can see from the pictures, it's the mm. same person. Crystal clear. Once there was cancer, now cancer, cancer is gone. Cancer is gone. What God cannot do, trust me, does, does not, not exist. exist. Mm. 
Mm. Wow. Mm. When we talk about miracles that sound like lies, this is one this of them. This is one of them. I'm glad he had pictures to back yes. it up because, yes. I mean, this is unbelievable. Yes. Yes. God is awesome. Yes. What he cannot do does, does not, not exist. exist. Mm. Cancer of the eye. Mm. Gone just like that. Mm. One day here, next gone day gone. Dramatically. Gone you know, my it looks, God. It looks like a movie. You woke up with something today. You know, it almost looks like Neyman going to wash in mm -hmm. the Jordan. By the sixth time, he was still a leper. He was still a leper. He now took Dipped one more the, step, the next came time. out, <laughs> where was leprosy? Gone. And he disappeared Gone. just in one swoop. Gone. You know, God, I like how dramatic God gets, yes. you know, when he wants to do some of these things. Yes. And, you know, it's beyond argument. Yes. This is not... There was a city scan before there was city, there was a city scan after so there's no argument there's no argument there's no argument there's no there's a, there was a histo pathology mm. right a biopsy mm. like establishing, uh, establishing this, was that this happened mm. and then by the hand of the lord by the word of the lord hey, to the servant, yeah, that, you know, they, god is you know, good you know, when when you're on nsppd and you hear certain words of knowledge mm. that's actually someone's problem somewhere you may not know you may yes. not be the one who has yes, it yes 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 that's yes yes so and I like that the first word that came that he held on to, mm. that he was referring to, it may not even have really been his word, mm -hmm. but he shall mm -hmm. held on to something. He held on to it. And then the second one was now his own. Mm. Just him mm. had the second one. Mm. And here we have a testimony. Um, someone needs to begin to hold on. Even when you've not heard your word, just hold, hold, on. hold on to the one you've mm, heard mm, and your own word is still mm, coming. Mm. And most importantly, your miracle will Amen. show up in just a matter of Amen. time. Amen. Amen. Mm. Wow. Phenomenal testimony. Cancer of the eye gone. Our next two testifiers, we have Miss mm. Siliaja Baisani and Miss Anita Ken Switzer. And they both passed board exams after multiple attempts. Phenomenal testimonies. Watch mm. this and we will be right back. Ladu does not exist. I am Saila Japaisani and I'm a physician and a psychiatrist in United States of America and I'm giving my testimony today. So I'm originally from India and I follow Hindu religion. Um, when I went to school during my childhood, I did go to Christian missionary school and that's when I came to know about Jesus. So I have not been passing my psychiatry board exam for the last four years due to many obstacles. This year, uh, I decided that I'm not planning to give this exam any more longer. And I also was diagnosed with rheumatoid arthritis in the month of July and August of this year. It became very difficult for me to prepare for the board exams and I was almost crying every day. A good friend of mine who is also a psychiatrist in the United States, her name is Tola. She gave me the link for this altar of fire for NSPPD. In the beginning, I started listening to the prayers and since I am not a Christian, I had some difficult time to follow initially and I was asking my friends to explain few things. Later, I started listening to the prayers every day without missing them any. I became a member of NSPPD in the month of October. I gave my board exam in the month of September of this year. And I have been praying God that I will not plan to give this exam anymore even if I fail. And finally, on November 30th, my results came and I passed my psychiatry board exam, which was a shocking news to me. And I think the only reason that I passed this exam is because of God's grace and with the help of Jesus Christ and with Pastor Jerry East and his crew offering the prayers to everyone. I am very thankful and I want to give all glory to Jesus Christ and I also want to thank wholeheartedly to Pastor Jerry East and Pastor Eno, Pastor Uguru and the entire SPPD crew members for offering all these prayers and making our lives better every day and I cannot wait to come back to give more testimonies and what God cannot do does not exist what God cannot do does not exist what our God cannot do does not exist I have passed, I have passed, I have passed my 
in class. What God cannot do, does not exist. Papa say we shut up. We not God. Hey, it is true. It is true. Thank you. What God cannot do, does not exist. What my father in heaven cannot fix does not exist. My name is Anita Ken Twitter. I am I'm, I'm making this testimony from US, New Jersey to be precise. God is faithful. Since I left nursing school last year, December, I have been trying to pass one exam, one exam, one exam that will grant me my license so that I can work as a nurse. As a graduate nurse, you cannot work. You need your, your license. You need to be licensed to be able to work. And the name of that exam is NCLEX. I wrote my NCLEX. I wrote the first, my first attempt was in June. I failed, but I read. Prior to that time, I read. I would read from morning till night. I would read. I would read and read and read and read and read. I went there and I failed. I failed. And then I, I said, okay, maybe I did not read well. Maybe I should do that because I was reading from home, right? Maybe I should go to the library. <laughs> I went to the library. I would go to the library for money till 3 p.m. before I get off again and pick the kids. I would read. I would read. That was my life Monday to Friday nonstop, even sometimes on Saturday. I would read. I would read. I went again in September and I failed. I failed. <laughs> a lot of people have been stuck oh god i was crying i was frustrated i was depressed i remember the sunday after they said if you know you're depressed come out i was the first person in the altar i was not ashamed i was depressed i started again i said god every time i would say god what is it that i have done wrong that you cannot forgive me god guess what <laughs> i joined the altar <laughs> I said, may God not let us see problem oh. Because prior to that time, I've been they've been sending me the links and I've been procrastinating. Oh, it is 1 a.m. Oh, it is 2 a.m. American time. Oh, how can I wake up? Oh my God. My dear. <laughs> when I failed the second time, nobody told me. That 7th of September night, I started, I joined the altar of fire. I was praying. I'm at work and I, I would stay there and I'm praying. And I am praying. I will pray. I will pray. The first word came, September 13th. Papa said, there's somebody here. Receive your Rema award. You shall not fail that exam anymore. God has sent you help. You shall not fail it anymore. I claimed it and I said, Amen. Don't say it, the Lord. Receive it as your Rema award. You will not fail that exam again. You will not fail that exam again. You will not fail that exam again. Let your Amen turn the louder. As if that was not enough, the same word came in um, October 21st. There's somebody here. She shall, you shall not fail that exam anymore. She shall not fail that exam. I killed into it and I said, Amen. You have failed that exam several times, oh. but don't say the Lord, you will not fail it again. You will not fail it again. Help us come. 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 Let your image turn the louder. Hey, Papa God did you told us to print everything that we wanted. I printed. So this is my number one prayer request. This is my head day. I did. Number one. Papa, look at me. I, 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 I printed a good pop-up. Official. Official pass. I went to Google. I printed official pass. I wrote November. November 2022. Anita will become a registered nurse. I did it again. Look at it. Almost there. This is the good pop-up. I have been seeing bad pop-up twice. I want to see good pop-up. This is good pop-up. This is the beginning. This is good pop-up. My case. Anita will become a registered nurse. Look at it. It is here. It's here. Anita can see. Look at my name. See, that was not enough. I think that was not enough. Oh, I have to be above the ground because it's computer that even exam. I still went. Oh, I went. Papa, you said print everything that you want to see. I did. This is me all above the ground. All above the ground. This is number one in my prayer request. Oh, Papa, this one. This one is the key to a new home that I was trusting God for. Now, let me now wrap this testimony up. On Tuesday, November 15th, I got the key to a new home. Yes. Yes, God did it. God did it. It was on my prayer request. Oh, this is the cure. This is the cure. I see that was not enough. I went to write my anklets. That scary anklets. Oh, you don't want to know how I passed. God showed up with me. 
I did not only pass, I passed with distinction. The second attempt, my computer shot me off at 75. I said, oh, you failed woefully, Baba Yanida. This time, my computer shot me off at 75. I said, God, not again, not again, not again. Guess what? He said, Anida, don't doubt, don't doubt, because I'm with you. I passed. I passed. I passed. I passed. I passed. I received my congratulations on fr on on, um, on Friday morning. Congratulations, Anita. You have passed the anchors with my arrow and number. I am on the board of nursing. Oh, I am there. I am there. Life. I am there. I am there. With my frame boost certificate. Oh, Jesus. If this is not you, then what is it? If this is not you, then what is it? God, I love you. I love you, God. For what God cannot do does not exist. Before I answered every question from number one to 75, I said, what God cannot do does not exist. Three times, even before I looked at that question. Three times before I looked at that question. God, I love you. Hey. Hey. <laughs> oh wow. my god, I like the excitement of yes, this lady. Yes, yes, oh yes. My oh, god, oh my god. god. She was mm. stuck at mm. a transition gate. She had yeah. graduated, but to yeah. get her practicing license, yeah. and she was stuck there. Mm. And of course, we had our first testifier, Miss Sila Silaja. Mm. 40 years. I mean, you can imagine that Miss Anita's excitement was just one year. Yeah. That was last year. She had written three yeah. times. 40 this years. One, uh... 40 years of the same psychiatric uh, yes 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 trying about. to get the license to practice you cannot even begin to imagine the implication mm. because you've worked you've studied and now it's time to earn yeah it's like harvest season yes. so to say yes. and yes. you're unable to practice yes there's financial implication you can't yes. move you're stagnated you're just yes. stuck at a transition gate yes. for years without end, not until they join the fire altar. You know, uh, Apostle Paul was right. One of the letters of Apostle Paul, he said, we tried several times mm, to come mm, across mm, to you, mm. but Satan hindered, hindered us. us. Now, when you look at the word of the Lord for, especially this um, last, you know, excited lady, mm -hmm. you it's see that um, she failed. Mm. She failed again. Mm -hmm. And then the man of God gave a word and said, you failed an exam. God is sending help. Mm. Now, help moved her from failure to distinction. Distinction, not just someone, average. Someone who had been failing. Yes, now, you yes, would yes. imagine that if someone is failing, mm. um, he, has a way a of, he has a way of um, uh, painting a picture of someone who's not so intelligent yes, 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 yes. or an average student yes, yes, yes. or someone who uh, just didn't have that little extra to mm. pass mm. or someone who just needed a little extra and pass Absolutely. and barely pass. Yes. But what you see is that God sent help, and this was hey! not help, help for average um, no. uh, success. It was help for distinction. distinction. So locked up in this young lady hey! was the capacity to have distinction. Mm. But she tried again and again, and perhaps like Apostle Paul said, Satan hindered her. And she put in good effort until, too. Good until effort. God now showed up yes. with help, yes, as yes, the man yes. of God said. Yes. And this help moved her from failure to, to distinction. distinction from failure hmm. to distinction from not being able to even pass because if you mm. even pass if you even barely pass the important thing is that you've passed yes but this is from failure, failure. to distinction. distinction so she now has a result that is like you know when you have a distinction in this kind of thing you're considered like amongst the best. Yes, the elite. The, you're you're yes, no the longer, top. you're not considered an mm. average person. You're mm, considered mm, mm, like amongst the best. Mm, mm. From failure to being counted amongst the, the best. best. You know, this when, God, when God wants this to is do the help things, of when the Lord. God wants to help a man, mm. he helps you thoroughly. And anyone who sees just knows that, see, this is the help of God that has shown up for this person. Mm. This is the help of God. Because while she was waiting to even pass the exam, Mm. You know, she joined the of Fire 7th or so of November. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Within one week, her word came. Mm. You know, sometimes I just, you know... God well, shows I, mercy I, to, I, to newcomers. I don't know how God does it. Yes. Someone has had to write a Facebook post about it, that God, you know, just... Um, someone just shows up. He shows mercy. And it's as if God is just waiting he's for the waiting, person. He's and waiting, he's waiting. the story of this girl. Yes, she yes, shows yes. up on NSPPD. Within one week, God has done something. Before this same month, month of November over. was mm, over, mm. she already got a key to her house. Ah. She already got the, the distinction from yes, failure yes, yes. to distinction. Come on. God is um, awesome. Sometimes you almost think he's like God chooses some people to be <laughs> nice to them. And, 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 but I mean, he's all by himself. Yes. And I just see 
a, a, a bridge they were unable to cross. Yes. But by the hand of God, yes. by the word of the Lord, by yes. the help of God, yes. they've been able to cross. Yes. And what looked difficult before, yes. now, now I'm not asking myself, wow, you could have a distinction. Right. Why were you failing? Yes. Something was wrong. Yes, yes, yes. But the hand of the Lord and the word of yes. the Lord made what was wrong to become right. Yes. That it moved from failure all the way to distinction. Oh. And I mean, you can imagine our first um, testifier. She's not even a Christian. She's yes. Hindu. She so, wasn't. Oh, Christian. sorry. She wasn't. She now is, you yes. know. And we see God show mercy oh. again and again and again, you know, to unbelievers, to Muslims, to Hindus. Just this week, I think yes. we had another testifier yes. that was a Muslim yes. who God showed mercy to. So God in, is amazing. He crossed. In, you know, one thing about God, uh, in fact, God... Um, once you approach God without acting familiar with God, mm. there's nothing God cannot do for mm. you. That is why um, Jesus was talking about the one leper who came back. Mm. And he said, why were, were they not people to come back except this Samaritan? Mm. This one that came back was mm. not a Jew. Was a Samaritan. He was a Samaritan. Mm. The one that came back was not familiar. Was not familiar with him. He was grateful. Mm. He had the heart to mm. receive Meanwhile, the ones that were Jews were still going to look for the yes, priest to tell them. Familiarity had set in. You understand? Mm. So once you approach God with that open heart, right? Once you get on the altar of fire with that open heart, and you're like, okay, God, I want to see what you will do. Right. Now that those are the people God wants to even reach out. To. I, I'm tempted to think, yes, faith is important, mm. but it's important. And I dare say it's even more important, just come with your heart. Just open your heart and come to God. Right. You don't even, there's nothing you are going to do to impress God. God mm. is already God. Mm. No human being can impress God. Mm. So faith moves God, no doubt. Mm. But just even have your heart open and say, God, I hear you've been doing this. I hear you've been helping people that, you know, have been struggling for 40 years. That's a long time. Mm. And then you've helped someone for 40 years and the person came to the altar of fire and the seed was broken. Uh, someone um, uh, had the womb cut off and mm. the person came to the altar of fire and the womb was replaced. I heard you've been doing this. Can you just can show you, through my life my that life? you can do it? And yes. so, and God does it and you see that this same thing, the person may be a Muslim, mm. the person may be anything, mm. but God shows up and he shows off. And this is the power of God and this is what happens on the altar of fire. Yes. It doesn't have to be a Christian. He doesn't discriminate. Like he is not. He the, shows the mercy altar to of whom fire, he will show mercy the to. The altar of fire yes. is open to everybody. Yes, yes, yes. Come as you are. Come as you come are. Come with your problems. Yes. And come and take your solution because your solution is waiting for you at the altar of fire. Right. Mm. Amazing. Amazing. Mm. What they could not do before. 40 years knocking at an iron gate. Mm. And when she received the help of mm. the Lord, when mm. she received mm. the mercy mm. of God, mm. she was able to do mm. what she could not do before. Mm. What stopped her in the past mm. could not stop her again. Mm. Wow, amazing mm. testimony. This yeah. week, you are receiving the help of Amen. the Lord in Jesus' Amen. name. Amen. Wow, Amen. our next two testimonies are testimonies of marital settlement. It is raining marriages. <laughs> I mean, this week, we had a testimony of um, two weeks, two weeks engagement, mm, you know, mm. we saw a woman in her 40s get married and our next two testifiers are women that got married, God settled them maritally in spite of existing conditions. We'll get to that in a bit. We have our testimony from Ms. Mm. Chidima mm. Asonye, testifying mm. from Owere State, Owere Imo State, Nigeria. And we have Ms. Stella Omale, testifying from Lagos State, Nigeria. Watch this and we'll be right back. Asonye Chidima, I am testifying from Owere. Indeed, what God cannot do does not exist. I want to testify of the Lord's faithfulness and His goodness in my life and in the life of my family. I want to testify that I am that woman God has shown mercy. I am that woman God has remembered. I am that woman God that after almost four years of being a widow, God remembered me today and gave me a new name. God has changed my status. Earlier this year, I never knew that I would be where I am today. I called on God. I told him I need a change. I need a change in my status. After the death of my husband for almost four years, humanly speaking, it looks as if there is no headway. 
I want to thank God specifically for hearing my cries on NSPPD altar every morning when I call on him. Truly, today is my time and my turn to celebrate. God has shown me mercy. There's nothing God cannot do. God has been so faithful. God has been so kind. Each night after NSPPD's prayers, I wake up and kneel down and continue with my prayers. God heard me and answered me bountifully, surprisingly. He gave me a new name. But today, my status has changed. I am having my wedding today. It can only be God. Indeed, what God cannot do does not exist. bountiful blessings this year. This year, my immediate younger brother just wedded in July. And me, today, I am getting married. Just barely one month after that. My immediate younger, our uh, last born in the house, is also getting married, about to wed. God has been so fed. Indeed, what God cannot do does not exist. Praise the Lord. My name is Stella Omale, and I'm giving this testimony from Lagos, Nigeria. It all began um, immediately after my introduction. I had my introduction last year. We picked a date for the wedding, you know. So immediately the process of the wedding started, precisely um, June, July of 2022. I woke up to a spot on my chest. The spot is just like painful. They placed me on medication, nothing was working. In fact, the fourth or fifth day, the pain was so much, I cannot put on anything. Everywhere, every part of my body was covered, even my scalp, my ear, my tongue, my nostrils, under my eyelid, everywhere was covered. Friends that were very close to me, they started calling, they said, I started connect to NSPPD. I connected one morning. I was shedding tears, I was weeping. I said, God, what is this? What have I done wrong? Who have I offended? Please have mercy on me. God of NSPD, please have mercy on me. God of Pastor Jerry, please have mercy on me. God, please show me mercy. I was on that, I was connected that morning. The pain became too terrible. I didn't even know when my phone slided. I, I, I started weeping. I started weeping and I said, God, this pain is unbearable. Please just take my life, kill me. Let me just die because I can no longer bear this pain. I cannot sit down, I cannot lie down, I cannot swallow. Everything was, I don't know how to describe it. It continued that way. I was taken away from the house. They had to take me somewhere where no, where no one could visit me. I couldn't speak with anyone. It was just me. All this while, I thought the young man would give up, but he was there. He was there, 247 with me. He kept on. Two friends of mine, they are both NSPPDians. Once chatted me and said, Stella, please come online, come online. Pastor Jerry just mentioned your case. He said, the, um, the, there's a lady here. You have some rash on your body. The rash is uh, on your back, uh, all over your back. Uh, 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 and the Lord is showing me, uh, even to your front, uh, labor, uh, all over your body. Uh, I don't know who you are, but if this is the word of the Lord, if you will not give back your testimony, let it dry up. I tapped, I, I said I received it in Jesus' name. I started begging, I said, I have a wedding in four months. Don't let people see traces of it. As you can see, this is my face. I'm not using filter. And that was how everything cleared. That is the first side of the story. While I was down, one week into that sickness, my dad chatted me that he was very sick. I thought it was just the normal malaria, you know, and typhoid. Until one um, night at, at around 12 a.m. in the morning, my phone started ringing. I was still in this pain, no? They said, come, 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 come. Your dad is not 
feeling fine. In fact, if you do not get here before 5 or 6 a.m. in the morning, you might not meet him alive. Ah, what is going on? That was how we rushed to. In fact, the condition we saw him was terrible. He was behaving insane, like he was mad, I don't know. So we rushed him somewhere. They said his malaria and typhoid that it was too much it has entered into his brain. Some said it's not physical, it's spiritual. We was just talking out of points. Every day, I and my sister will connect to NSPPD. Before six, we are already on. We waited everything. And then this phase today, I can't even remember the, that particular day precisely. Pastor Jerry mentioned this case. He said, you are connected here, you are here. It started like uh, malaria. They said it's malaria. Um, malaria and typhoid, it entered his brain his brain and is behaving insane by the power that raised jesus christ from the dead i command it to go out of him i don't know who i'm talking to your loved one started running fever from there they said it is malaria that got to his brain from there they now said it is a full-blown psychiatric case that is how we progress to where you are right now to where you are right now it has refused to go if you are the one put it on the live stream and never as the amen of nsbbd has returned i command let this affliction break by fire let it break by fire immediately i commented i said see 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 they just mentioned that this case just mentioned i claimed i claimed i claimed i started shouting i said god all this period i'm talking about my dad has been taken to the village he was already mad neighbors and young men in his area they had to go and pick him up from the streets naked they tied him up to the glory of god he is healed my dad returned back to lagos two weeks to my wedding and he was alive to walk me down the aisle i really want to i just want to appreciate god i had my wedding on 26th of november 2022 devil tried all this and on that day of my wedding while at the reception i was dancing in they ushered me into dancing and suddenly they came again i could not move my leg was stiff for close to five to ten minutes i could not move a muscle i started shouting blood of jesus blood of jesus blood of jesus blood of jesus and to the glory of god everything was successful i really want to give god the glory i want to thank you pastor jerry and every member of NSPPD, all the crews of NSPPD, I say God bless you. What God cannot do does not exist. To so God be all the glory. Hey! Mm. When the devil reduces a man, mm. Mm. can you even believe that that same man mm. that was walking his daughter elegantly, majestically, is the same man same was that was bound mm. and, you know, stripped mm. naked and mm. had lost his mind just mm. a few mm. weeks prior? Mm. Mm. My God. My God. Hey! You know, <laughs> hey! Afflictions, you know, people, um, a lot of times, you know, people imagine once you maybe are a child of God, nobody wants to attack you anymore. Mm. But afflictions are real. Yes, yes. This lady hadn't even gotten married, just did hadn't, introduction. Just introduction. And something I can only describe as a demonic crash yes, came out yes, of nowhere, yes. of, obviously. targeted her face. Her and, entire you know, body. You know, covered, mm. the, you know, disfigured her. Disfigured her. And while they were at it, a week later, her dad, her dad goes, went goes, you mental, know, goes out there, of nowhere. You know, and um, all of a sudden, because something good, and this is what, you know, it reminds me of the scripture. The Bible says Jesus was telling a parable and was giving an example of how negativity shows up. Right. Right, because that's what parables are. Jesus was explaining how things work, and he said a good man planted good seed. Mm. And while men slept, mm. his enemy came. Mm. It wasn't a random passerby. His it enemy. Was his enemy. Yes. Who came and sowed tars amongst the wheat and went his way. Mm. And so a man has made an effort expecting a harvest. Mm. The enemy comes and plants something that makes ah. the harvest to be impossible. Mm. The enemy showed up and put up something that will compete. Yes, 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 with yes, yes. The wheat. Anticipated harvest. Mm -hmm. Yes, something that will stifle the anticipated harvest. Mm. You know, and, and that's what I just see here because, but but the, the good thing, is that the young man who was to marry her. Mm -hmm. May God bless us with such people. Amen. People who Amen. see disaster coming Amen. and they are like we are standing by yes, yes, to yes. watch this thing blow mm, over. Mm, and the mm, man stayed back there mm, and, and, and remained mm, and eventually they got married. Mm, I mean, some people would have walked away. Right. Some people would have said, ah, this thing that is happening in her family. Yes. And you have not even entered. It's an indication you not even married, that you should build. Just shift. You mm, know. So, mm. but 
they uh, thank God for that young man. Yes. He stayed back. And then this affliction, the moment they realized it was an affliction mm. and brought it to the altar, altar of, of fire. fire. This is the responsibility of the altar of fire. Mm. Bring affliction there, leave the affliction there, let fire answer to the affliction. Hmm. And fire answered. And by the time you sing, you know, she had to emphasize, see, I'm not using a filter. Yes. This, this was not makeup. No filter. Mm. With all that the enemy tried to do. Yes, yes, yes. God wiped it wiped away it no and, left no, and left no traces. Yes. She will have to tell you that she had been through that before. Yes, yes, yes. I mean, I, I like when God, you know, if God heals and there's a scar, it is mm. still healing. Mm, it is mm, still mm. divine healing. Yes. But when God heals and, and leaves, leaves no, no trace, scar, and leaves no evidence that this even happened before, yes, yes, yes. that people will have to be told ah. that, do you know I've gone through this before? Mm, mm, mm. You know, it's 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 exciting. Mm. And, and, and not to forget about the other the other lady yes, who yes, I actually yes. know oh, personally. Wow. You know, yeah, wow. I know her personally. Mm. I know when her husband died. Oh. And oh. they <laughs> and I saw <laughs> the testimony. Mm. You know, four years after, mm. I know when her husband died. Hey! And, you know, but my, my excitement is about how she believed God, how she was waiting for God to show up. Yes. How she was placing a demand and saying, God, do something yes, about yes, this. Yes, yes, yes. Because she's just a young lady. Wipe my tears. She's a young lady. Mm. Like, she's a young lady. Mm. She, you know, not that anybody is qualified to become a widow, but... Someone shouldn't become a widow yes, at yes, that yes, age. Yes, 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 yes. That's not the promise of God. You know, that's not the promise of God. Mm. Someone shouldn't become a, a widow. A, a, I don't want to say small girl. Mm. Becoming a widow as a small girl. Ah. So, but I, and I'm still here to see. You're still here. That to when see God, the Lord right turned that around the Kala captivity of Zion. <laughs> ah, God is good. God is God good. God is, God is, God is sweet. You know, it is nice is when sweet. people who ah. saw your tears. Mm. And that is what Psalm 126 says. Yes, it yes, says, yes. Those that have sown in tears will doubtless come doubtless rejoicing. Come yes. So I saw her tears. And I'm seeing her, her laughter. days of laughter, yes. her days of joy. Glory the to God. The new chapter that God, only opened. God would have opened. Only God could you have know, done there this. there are people that would say, oh, you've been married before. Ah, no. No. But God decided to give her her own mm. again mm. and change her name mm. and, and, and put a smile on that face that had wept several. Oh, you God know, is the, good. It, God is a good God. And, yes. And, you know. Um, it would appear that that chapter had closed. Mm. But we, we serve a God who reopens yes. what you think is a closed yes, chapter. Yes, 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 yes. Who even brings a better chapter. Mm. Because that's what he did for Ruth. Mm, mm, Ruth mm. just lost right. her yes. regular husband. Yes, yes, yes. And when God would replace yes, yes, yes. the old with, the, with new, the new, it was an ushering in into a new dynasty that heaven was interested in. Ah, la da, you know, so, da, da. Uh, you know, so when I hey, see Hey, restoration God, with compensation. Yeah, with compensation. Mm. With real compensation. Mm, mm, mm. If the compensation is more than the restoration. Yes, yes, yes. So when, when, God, when God does things, you mm. just know that... This is the finger this of God. This is the finger of God. It is not, it is yes. not by the scheming yes. of man. No it is way. not even by mere wishes. No, no, no. It is the hand of God. It is, the hand of, it the is Lord. the hand of God doing what no man would have done. Mm, mm. You know, so I, I feel excited for, you know, testimonies are just, I mean, recently and beyond the testimonies we've re reviewed today, you see God just doing the, he has always done the impossible, right? right? But he's now doing the the real impossible yes yes like yes things I that know. are the 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 real impossible yes like bigger impossibilities mm, mm, mm. and he's just mm. you know making a mess of bigger of impossibilities mm. you know and I, the the more I see this the more I tell myself it doesn't make sense not to even believe God mm. what what is there that God cannot deal with what is there not to believe God for mm. what is there not to trust God for mm. what is there not to count on God for. Mm. If these people could count on God yes. and God will show up for them, why won't he show up for me? Mm. Why won't he show up for you? Why you won't know, he show up for people you know, on the altar? God is a God of happy endings. 
just happy endings. He makes mm. everything beautiful. Yes. You know, and you know, when he remembered her, he didn't just mm. remember her. It was now a family celebration. Yes, yes. She, yes. her sister, her brother, three mm -hmm. weddings mm -hmm. in three months. In the same happening family. Happening at the same time. In a family where the only one that, the one that married had Had cried, lost someone. And then God shows up and says, you know what, I want to, this thing needs to be loud. Yes, 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 This yes. one needs to be loud. Ka -ya let the brother get married. Da. Okay, let the one oh, that is a widow. Loud. Let the one that is a mm. widow get married again. Mm. Then let the younger one also get also married. Also marry. So, you back know, when to people, back to back. some people that miss the first wedding, when they hear again, they say, it's not that wedding I say, that say no, there's a new there's one. There's another one. Okay. <laughs> Whoa! God is good. God is sweet. God is good. When God he is shows beautiful. Up, when he show, shows up, he shows off. Yes. When he shows up, yes. he does what no man yes. can do. Yes. Mm. And you know, he's the alpha and he's the omega. Aha. The devil does Preach. not have the right Preach. to omega your story. Aha. He's not the omega. God Aha. is the one that, the only licensed, authorized power that, mm -hmm. can, end, that, can, end that can end what he started. What he started. And so the devil can be allowed to play in between. Yes. So that is just a suspense. Yes, story. yes, yes. But the one the who script writer, Kali Bali Shadata, the one who hey, will finish. Will finish. The one who began will, will conclude. So um, <laughs> it's it's exciting seeing how God makes laughter, bets laughter yes. for a family. Yes. One person cried. Then he now says, you know what? The whole for family. For that cry, the whole family. For the whole will laugh. family. Yes. Let the whole family. Let, yes. let just be. Let there be wedding, wedding, hey. wedding, wedding. Asebi. You know. You just imagine. They say, "Oh no, we're wearing another color." Yes, yes, you know, they yes. Wear, they have to wear three different. <laughs> three I'll be, different I'll, colors. I'll be angry with them if they wear the same color. <laughs> they have to wear one color for that brother, one color for this sister now. Yes. Then another color another for the color. younger sister. Ah, <laughs> glory God to is God. Good. What God cannot do does, does not, not exist. exist. Mm. God is beautiful. Yeah. God is beautiful. Mm. Wow, mm. what amazing testimonies we yeah, have heard yeah, today. Yeah. I mean, our first testifier, we saw Mr. Ali, cancer of the eye mm. that had begun to progress mm. and God reversed it right yes. here by one word, mm. by one word mm. on the altar of mm. fire. Amazing, phenomenal testimony. Then we saw, of course, our two sisters, Miss Silaja mm. Baisani and Miss yeah. Anita Kenswitza, both passed board exams after repeated attempts and, you know, our first Miss Sylvia, Miss Silaja was after 40 years of trying. Wow. Wow. You know, and then, of course, we have our fourth and fifth testifiers, marital settlement. We saw Miss Chidima Asonye, Miss Stella Omale, marital settlement. One was a widow and the other one was settled, you know, despite the repeated efforts of the enemy to frustrate that wedding, God came through and settled them maritally. To him alone be all the glory. Mm. Wow. Pastor mm. Dr. DK, thank you for joining us today. Thank you for inviting me. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. What a rich, robust conversation we've had. The pleasure we is mine. We are about to wrap up. Can you say something to our audience before we go? Oh, well, there's nothing more to say rather than to say that what God cannot do does, does not, not exist. exist. If, if it's an impossibility, mm. it is within God's zone of yes. comfort. Yes, yes, yes. may be uncomfortable ah. about impossibilities, mm. but impossibilities it's his are comfort in zone. God's Kaya comfort zone. Desha. They are hey. in God's comfort zone. Mm. Bring your possibilities mm. to the altar of fire yes. it is god's comfort zone mm. to deal with your impossibilities mm. Mm. you know um if there's anything at all that there is to learn from the devil mm. Mm, it's his resilience yes he doesn't give up and that's where believers we don't um we need to understand the art of warfare and mm. we need to understand our opponents he doesn't give up you can imagine our last testifier on the day of her wedding mm. despite all that had happened her leg, you know, there was, you know, she couldn't walk, she couldn't move. And, you know, I'm just trying to say, what I'm trying to say is that we need to get back in the zone. Mm. There's no such thing as, oh, I, I prayed yesterday, I'm tired of praying. Mm. The enemy that is fighting against you yeah. is not tired. It's so true. you cannot be tired. My way of saying that NSPPD <laughs> continues Monday morning, 7 a.m. Nigerian time. It's time to dust yourself off and get back into the ring because it must end in praise. It must end in testimonies. There will be no carryovers. That blessing that God has intended for you 
the yeah, marked for 2022 will not be carried over into mm. 2023 in the yeah. mighty name of Jesus. Amen. 7 a.m. Nigerian time. Come back and do not come back alone. And the strange acts of God continues. 7 a.m. Saturday morning. Same time, same time. Come back and join us and you'll be blessed and glad that you did. Do you have a testimony of your own? Go ahead and send in your testimonies to the testimony number written at the bottom of the screen and be a blessing to someone else. Have you clicked on the share button today? Go ahead and click on the share button. Let the world know that God is still in the business of doing impossibilities. Are you following us on all of our social media handles? Go ahead and... Click on the like and subscribe to our page, Facebook, Instagram, every single social media handle, Streams of Joy is there. Go ahead and click on the subscribe button so that you never miss a show. You're always up to date to what God is doing in the now. Mm. Wow, Pastor Dr. DK, always a delight having you with me in studio. Thank you once again you for so your time. For that brings us to the end of our show. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you so much for sharing. Till next week, Saturday, remember, what our God cannot do does, does not, not exist. exist.